Hello, and welcome back to Hitman. We're back. Um, I did want... We're going to do Mendoza, um, which is one of the last maps of the story, at least. Um, but I did want to finish up the Pride Perfusion real quick. Um, I did the Ambivalence Challenge, which was basically... Don't listen to him, listen to him, don't listen to him again. And so now I'm going to do the listen to him on each level. Um, and see, I just wanted to show off his voice lines and stuff. Because, you know, I kind of liked it. It was fun. But, uh, but, yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll go straight to Mendoza real quick. Comet, what are you doing? Your tail, why are you looking at your tail so much? 47. 47, can you hear me? You need to wake up. Don't! Listen to her. We don't need her anymore. She what does she know? know? Sitting behind her desk, telling you what to do and not getting her hands dirty. You are much better than that. You are the apex predator. Celebrate your talent and impress the peacock. Show them how it's done. All right, so now I gotta listen. Now, 47. First things first. You must find the peacock. Not worth your time. Okay, so we got to do everyone that makes it harder. So the other the last time we did this it was easy and it was quick, but now we got to do the harder challenges which might get a little annoying, but we'll try it out. And see what goes on. Yes, the long staircase. Ascend them and greet the peacock. The one that I already did in order to do the ambivalence one was the second one where I had to use syringes, so hopefully that will go a lot easier the than I did. Majestic peacock. Proud. It brings gifts, but don't be tempted to choose the obvious. Explosives. Loud. Effective. And hardly the choice of a silent assassin. Wouldn't you say? Now we're talking, 47. You demand a challenge, and you will have it. No easy street for you. I'm proud. Thanks. Okay, so totally different people I'm going to have to kill, too. I guess different targets. Okay. The other guy I think I saw was just in the apartment. Oh, that is your target. Go on. Do what you do best. City administrators are reporting a decrease... Oh. Homeless people in central Chongqing. The change is attributed to firmer attitudes and increased training among the city's police force. According to the meteorological service, it is expected to continue raining throughout the night and into the morning. Drivers in Chongqing are encouraged to be especially careful. Back on. Watch out! Impressive 47. I thought the bodies need to be hidden, so. Ridiculous. Just in case. The peacock will indeed be impressed. Oh, and why not go all the way to cover your tracks and hide the bodies? Like a true professional. There we go. Now let's go... Not, uh... Can I go this way? No, not this way. Just go back the regular way that I came. I guess I could have done that too. So this guy... On the top, oh, it's this fucker. Okay, I could have actually kept going up, but I can. Nope. I never opened this one, I don't think. Ah, uh, this is... This is a, the guy's place. The inspector. Useful, though. Because then I could go... 
right here. The second one, I'm going to have to go over here, too. Ooh, a target. Do what you do. What can I say, 47? That was a stunning performance. You should be proud. Absolutely smashing. Well done. Now, find an exit, 47. That one's not too far. I can get to there. I'm worried about the last one. So the second one, which I'm going to have to do in a second. So I got to kill three targets with the syringe and not be spotted. So it starts to get a little harder every time. And I really hope it's not that crazy. It's gonna give me a time limit for the third one, watch, I already know. There we go. Nice. Oh, the third one is the Fiber Wire Classic. That's what it was. I wonder who the targets are. My five o'clock shadow right now. Feels weird. Magnificent. You've proven that you are the apex predator. Let's see if you can keep it up. What a beautiful night, 47. Find the peacock so we can get started. Hey, you're up there. Did you find it? I want all the details about your I'm impressed. Keep up the good work and don't take the good choice. If you can pull it off, that is. Oh, here we go. But can you do it without being spotted? Make me proud. This one wasn't too crazy, I guess. They're all on a different floor, though. This is the thing that fucked me up the most was just the first guy. I was like, really? Also, side note, I always love it when I'm playing a game, sorry, a map, I should say, in Hitman, and, like, I start the map, and I have no idea where everything is, and then now, like, I'm doing it, and I know exactly where everything is, I'm moving so smoothly now, it's so nice, it's like I'm learning, oh, fuck. you do, 47. What can I say, 47? That was a stunning performance. You should be proud. Do I have applause in the background? What is happening? Who's watching me? Open the goddamn. There. That's your target. 
Go, 47. Show me what you can do. 47. That was spectacular. Well done. And this is the last guy right here. I'm doing Look, it smoothly right that now. That is your target. Go on. Do what you do best. Move. Bravo. Seven nice. Bravo. Awesome. Awesome. It was a pleasure to see an expert at work. I would expect nothing less from a man. Thank you. Thank you. Well done. Find an exit. You know they do experiments in there. Some supernatural brain shit. I'm on a roll. Isn't that right, Comet? She's too busy licking her paws. What are you doing? What are you biting? Why are you biting your leg? What's wrong? You itchy? What's going on? I, put, I gave you medication. What are you doing? Alright, last one. This is where it gets a little crazy. I'm impressed, 47. Thanks. You've proven that no task is too much of a challenge. You should be proud. Now, let's end this with a bang. I've been through a lot. Right, 47. Let's get to work. Find the peacock. Don't you fucking look at me. What the hell was that? Security protocol overruled. First off, we're cool. We're access granted. Stop looking at me. You jerk. All right, cool. I'm impressed. Keep up the good work and don't take the easy path. Take forty-seven. You make me proud. only eliminate the targets. And you do not pacify us. Taking the do. easy option is not even on your radar. If you succeed, you are truly a legend. So why not raise the stakes? Harm any bystander in any way, and you will fail. I wish me luck. This is gonna suck. I don't have to hide the bodies though, which is nice. Oh, that is your target. Go on, do what you Access do best. Granted. You can what can I say? Shut the fuck up. That was a stunning performance. You should be proud. That worked out perfectly and very close, mind you. Okay. So now I have to go down one level. 
I think there's a dongle right here. Yep. Perfect. Can I throw any item to break? I can. Oh my god. I learned this now after how many maps and games and tries I've done. My god. Okay. Security protocol overruled. He's all the way over there. That's such a far. Oh, Imogen's coming. Imogen's coming. That's not good. Okay. I'll wait right here because she's going to go into this office. And then I can try to book it. Run through the simulations one more time. Oh, my God. How there. the hell? That's your target. Go, forty seven. Show me what you can do. I feel like I'm gonna fail this one. Oh, where's he going? Oh. Jeez. My neck is really tense. I've been on drone duty. Access granted. I'm gonna grab this real quick. I don't see why we came here. No, this is great. What? The fumes. I mean, I hear they really do you good. Don't come in here. Okay. Oh man, I could do with some relaxing fumes. You think we can reroute them? Nah, only we'll adjust the dose. <laughs> we should turn it off so they can see what we have to put up with. Yeah, uh, crank it up and kill everybody so we can have. Forty-seven. That was spectacular. Well done. All right, now I gotta get to the bottom level. Oh, open that door. I'm pretty sure I can go through it through here. I'm pretty sure. Security protocol overruled. Yes, perfect. Oh, it's her. Oh, I could definitely do this. Ooh, a target. Do what you do, 47. Security protocol overruled. Access granted. Perfect. Nobody can literally see her. Perfect. Put her there. And now we can get it the heck out of here. It was a pleasure to see an expert at work. Absolutely smashing. Well done. Now find an exit, 47. This way, this way. I have my shortcut this way. Yeah. There we go. Nice. What the hell? That worked out well. Sorry. I'm not trespassing. With an exception to him, I'm pretty sure I didn't get seen by anybody. 
People I killed don't count either. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. There we go. Nice. Got that completed. Finished that. And I believe that is now Chongqing completely done. What the heck? Why do you give me this idea? What are you doing? Let me double check. No, yeah, that's it. Okay, perfect. Lastly, Mendoza. Hopefully, my girl is not against me in any sense of the way. Let me marry Tamara Vidal. Don Archibald Yates. What the hell? I thought I had only one person to kill. I might replay the, the briefing again. I'm... Serve tomorrow a poison glass of wine. Matricide. A new microphone. A pen. Garden shredder. Electrocution. Grape crusher. By proxy. I don't know what that means. Okay. By hypothermia. Poison glass. And then regular stuff. Okay. Watch the video again. I don't remember. something. Buenos Aires International Airport this morning. Now watch this. Harold. Trail ends at the airport, but turns out that a top Providence operative owns a vineyard in the area. Don Yates, of infamous New York law firm Morgan Yates and Cohn. And get this, it's hosting his retirement party today. She's infiltrated them. She's sending a message. She needs my help. Could have fooled me. You don't know her. Anyway, if you're going after her, you'll need to deal with the Herald. Her name's Tamara Vidal, former CIA asset and political firebrand. She's a master of surveillance and the Constance's most trusted aide. She'll have eyes everywhere. You won't get far as long as she's in the game. Why are you telling me this? I thought you were out. Yeah. Old habits, I guess. Anyway, I... I need to go. See you around, 47. No, you no, won't. You won't. Okay, so when I originally watched this, I thought... Because the objective is not to kill them, I guess. Rondi Bay with Diana Burnwood and Mendoza and ascertain her allegiance. We're going in. Um, all right. Need my trusty thingamajig. Let's replace the coins because we hardly use the coins anyway. I want to do something else. Use a new item. All right, let's run it. Oh, there she is. You're not an idiot. Let's just humor him. Yates likes his little dreams. Don't be long. Is she talking to me? What is happening? Diana. They okay, they definitely know I'm here. Hello. You got my message. Okay, so you are on my team? 
You'd never get caught on camera. Not unless you wanted to be seen. So what's the play? You're not the only one who's been busy, 47. I'm this close to becoming the next constant. I'll be able to dismantle Providence from the inside. Only one man stands in my way. Don Yates. That weasel was the partner's legal counsel for years. He's the top candidate. But remove him from the playing field. It won't work. If Edward suspects... I will convince him you acted alone. Retaliation for Grey. Trust me. I know oh. I The Herald. Tamara Bedell. She has eyes everywhere. And they're all fixed on you. The plan won't work unless we take her out. She never leaves my sight for long. Whatever your plan is, I'll help you if I can. You're sure about this? As sure as I'll ever be. Huh? Huh? Why did I turn gray? What was that shit? Here, I got you an invitation. Just like old times. Thanks. Come find me when it's done. Good luck, 47. Do not eliminate Diana Burnwood. Okay. All right. Interesting. Okay, time to get the job done, I guess. So she's on our team. She wants to become the next constant. The ground's super loose here. If we fall, we're going to seem like such idiots. We won't fall. We just need to get the peak, and we are good. And look at the gorgeous view. You know it will be worth it. Everyone's going to be beyond jealous. What's over here? Oh, let me... I don't want mission story guidance on. And... For more than two decades, New York... Let me actually... Uh... It's fine, it's fine. We'll keep it blank. Mr. Yates, it's Aaron, sir, fr from the firm. I came as quickly as I could. Is this? Yes, sir, I have the files. Sorry it took so long, but I had to access our remote server to print everything, and I, I couldn't get my VPN to... Right. Sorry, sir. I'll be right inside. That's the same guy that was at the manor. Don Yates has originally summoned a junior partner from Morgan, Yates, and Colin to the estate, the attorney Aaron Ford Jr., who was also at Thornbridge Manor. Yep, when Alexa Carlisle died, is carrying a ledger of important documents and is scheduled to see Yates in person. Oh my lord, is that Akira Cuckoo? I, I've always wanted to see one in the wild. Oh, Gretchen. I love how that pacified him. The heck, research file. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna... has announced his retirement from the front. Oh, jeez, can you believe these people? I think the whole world is their playground. Don't Call back. Get to you, Pam. Let's just take it from the top. Damn, she was deep in that conversation, though. All right. I gotta go meet with Yates. He's up here. The Yates are genuinely crazy about me. Hey, how are you? God damn it. Uh, give me a second. I just need to check your pocket. You want to pass? What's the point of opening that? Okay. Hey, stop twitching. What? I'm not making my life easy here. Oh, I didn't know they do that. Okay. You are good to go. I had no idea they actually did that anytime. I mean, I, I hardly carry a briefcase in this game at all. Most of the time, you don't need one. Hey. How are you? Talk to Gaucho. Aaron Ford Jr. Don Yates is expecting me. Okay. Right this way, Mr. Ford. 
Why is this? Why is he Gaucho? Why do I know who he is? Thanks, Gaucho. Former lobbyist, a political advisor, why would Mr. Yates waste his time on a bunch of low-level bureaucrats? Even if they all wear the same wheel. You look like a lawyer, all right. Thanks. You got that killer instinct. It's a gift. Oh, there's a cannon. Cannon. There's a cannon. Looking good, man. Looking good. Thanks. Oh, we can kill him with the pen here. Thank you. I feel like oh, she's talking to Diana right now. I gotta knock him out though. Sorry, Gaucho. Wait, time out. Is there something with Gaucho? I swear I saw something about Gauchito. No. There's nothing about Gauchito. Where did I see Gauchito? What? I'm not crazy. Who the fuck? Oh. I need to get rid of this item. Oh, put it in, put it in here. Here he comes. Is there anything about a violin I should be using? There's a sniper nest going on. Oh. With Diana Burnwood. Interesting. I didn't know I could do that. Disguise yourself as Gaucho. Is that... Oh, wait. Is that the guy? Yes. What's this one? Hello, Cowboy is what it was called. Venito Yates. Why? Meet tomorrow at alley for a private word in the cinema. Target paint a watermelon for the sniper team with your camera. Target paint. Interesting. Asado fire pit. Ooh, the fire pit's going to be interesting. Okay. Okay. Sorry. I keep pausing it. I keep reading everything. Hello, Mr. Don Yates. Hello, sir. All right, you're on the clock, Aaron. Dazzle me. What do we got on Burnwood? She's an orphan. Parents killed by one of our clients, Blue Seed Pharmaceuticals. The experience taught her to seek justice outside the system. Would you like me to go through her records? They're quite extensive. Well, somebody did their homework. No, just her involvement in the 1% killings. Starting with our clients. Details, please. The gorier, the better. Well, here's one that might interest you. Janus, a retired KGB spy master, is eliminated in his adopted hometown of Whittleton Creek, Vermont, along with his bodyguard, a former Secret Service agent. The methods in question... One second, I'm saving real quick. Because sometimes there's like a, just a perfect time to kill them. I like doing that. Quite ingenious. Just take a look here. The Himapan Hotel, Bangkok. Renowned rock star Jordan Cross is assassinated along with Morgan Yates and Cohn senior partner Ken Morgan, mm. Cross's legal representative. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Yates. I don't suppose you'll want to see that. Nevertheless, I have the details right here. Hmm. Good work. Keep it up, Aaron. Ah, he got up. Where are you going? You leaving? Are 
Are we just, are we walking together? Take a good look at this woman. What do you see? A monster? Revolutionary? What woman? Fanatic, you talking about Diana? Violent extremist. You should. You should take a good hard look at this graceful woman with the ensuringly professional demeanor and imagine her hands soaked in the blood of your colleagues, including my friend and business partner, Ken Morgan. A bloody trail of carnage and destruction ending with the partners themselves and Arthur Edwards, our superior, the new supreme head of Providence, is giving her the keys to the kingdom. Now, does that seem right to you, my friends? Yes. They should get their blood flowing. Oh, he's just talking. He was, he was not talking to me. I thought he was. You going back in the room or do I have to reload? Yeah, I'll have to reload. Okay. This man did not even care about my presentation. He's like, keep it up. Cool. Wop. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. Who holds who holds a pen like that, bro? I was gonna say, where's my freaking thing? Oh, Diana's not talking to me. That's why. I was like, why did that feel so empty? Wait, you're Gaucho. Wait, you're not Gaucho. What the heck? Who are you? Your name was Gaucho. Okay, now they're just sitting together. I take it Edwards told you to chaperone me. Any idea why? You know why. Justice earned. Until Edwards is satisfied you're not sailing under a false flag, I will be his eyes and ears. I meant why you? I suppose I'm more perceptive than most. You're also very loyal. My guess is Edwards' decision to make me a herald is not too popular with the other heralds. We were at war about five minutes ago. Some people are funny like that. But not you. I admire the craft, the audacity. Everyone said Providence was untouchable and along you came. The way I see it, you did us a service. That's cold. Mm. I like you more already. Touche. Oh my god, Comet's snoring right now. Comet, what are you doing? I was like, what is that sound? I'm just tired, Ma. The Thank little baby is service, tired. Buddy. Oh, thank you. What are we doing here, Dexy? Monumental records are longtime clients of Morgan Yates and Co. Oh, Why what? Come show Don our support. I love a man He's in a uniform. Leech. Yo, is He's everybody I've known oh, here? Free bar, Heidi. How is any of this Tell me you didn't forget your Okay. Hey, didn't forget the Asado Torch, okay. hey, the Asado torch Miguel. But you did, though. Don Yates has hired two famous chefs, the Los Lopes brothers, to cook Argentinian barbecue for his guests. Fortunately, Pablo Loso has misplaced the torch to light the asado pit, and dinner is on hold until he reaches a replacement. It's traditional, after all. Interesting. Hmm, I don't know what lighting the asado pit would do, but I mean, I'm going to try. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. Oh, they're coming down here. 
Kalmia Bowman it has at the back of the throat? Don't mind me. Can you imagine Diana's freaking uh, point of view of me just appearing next to her multiple times in different outfits? She's like, okay, well, damn, he's he's on it. Let me guess, the Burnwood woman. That's right. Gates has arranged for the chief winemaker to take Burnwood and Tamara Vidal on a grand tour of the estate. Want to see the tag along? Not for my sparkling personality. This Burnwood woman sure has his panties and a twist. Wonder what the deal is. Yates' business is his business. Just get yourself ready and sign into the visitor center. Oh. Have a drink on my behalf. I don't drink. Makes me sentimental. Mr. Black? What is it? Message from Gabriel Vargas, the chief winemaker. Says the tour is about to start. They're waiting for you down by the grape fields. Okay. Now get out of my face. I don't know if I wanted to do that. I thought I had to turn into him, but I guess not. Here's all. Okay. Looking good today, sir. Burnwood was in league with Grey. She's responsible for killing how many of our people? But how could she be a herald? Because they're coming down too. I don't know how I'm going to be able to kill her over here. The tour is starting. Must be Burnwood and Vidal. And you must be Yates's garbage man. Damn. What's your excuse? Well, we're all here, it seems. Except for our guide, Mr. Vargas. Suppose someone ought to fetch him. Black, I'm looking in your direction. Yeah? Let me know how that works out for you. Well, this is fun. We have to find Mr. Vargas. What's up, yo? Hopefully they're just waiting. Ooh, this is how I get her to have hypothermia, though. Get her stuck in here. Do I need anything? Freeze door, missing screwdriver. They're still hanging out there, right? Oh, screwdriver. Nice. They're still waiting. Mr. Vargas, Mr. Vargas, where are you? Hmm. Now, the temperature and humidity in the barrel room is controlled by the ventilation system. What just happened? I never know what was going on inside the barrel room. Okay. Inside the barrel room. Oh, in here. You guys still standing still? Cool. Who the heck is Mr. Varbigus and where the hell is he? Diana! Don't worry. Just stay right there.
would have thought he's in here, but maybe he's... Diana, look at me. Stop looking at me. I'm dealing with some shit. Maybe Mr. Vargas is over here. Didn't mean to do that, but alright. If I was Mr. Vargas, where would I be? Got some grapes. For some reason. Okay, so he's not in the barrel room, the wine room, the wine making room, the grape harvesting section, tier one dongle, and a winery worker's key, and a screwdriver. I feel like I gotta get in there, but nothing allows me to get in there though. It's locked from the other side, I guess. Oh! There we go, nice. Am I trespassing? No, I was about to say, this is not a hostile area. Sir? Are either of you Mr. Vargas? Oh, I found the expensive wine. I have no idea what the code is, but I found it. What, what just happened? The wine fridge. The secure wine fridge next to the barrel room contains the wine fridge. Question why, but the access doors of which are made of ballistic can only be unlocked from the tournament in the stairs room. Or, you know, not. I'm sorry, what is that code? What does that say? It's a vintage year. What year is it? Wait. Wait, what's over here? Oh, that's where it came from. Wait, this is so cheating, but I'm pretty sure. 1945 Grand Palapine. Grand Palapin. Oh my god, that's hilarious. I technically don't need this. They're still waiting for me. But I'm gonna take it anyway. Why is it guarded? I wish I knew what this man looked like so I can grab him. I'm assuming I have to dress up like him and be like, hey. I just don't know where he's at. Don't know what he looks like, what he's doing. I just know Diana's waiting a long time to be guarded by Mr. Vargas. Oh, she's coming back. Okay, 
Can I send them back? The partners created a power cabal bound together by secret and back corruption. All the constant did was make it real. Enter the Destiny Group, a fully legal, entirely official, supranational corporate entity. I don't think I can. Each company becomes untouchable, moving beyond any state jurisdiction. Hello, Currently, sir. Let's head back to the party. Wherever you go, I go. Ooh, uh... Okay, so I don't think I can do anything. I guess I missed that opportunity? Maybe, maybe so? Watch me find him by accident. I will lose my mind. What is this man doing? It's a nice gesture, but a bit hubristic, wouldn't you say? Not even disappointed. Caution and modesty have never been Don Yates' style. The wine list? Let's rejoin the fun. Fine by me. Damn. Who the fuck is yelling? Who's yelling? Mr. Yates? Where are you, sir? Oh my god. You could please come towards my voice. I'll keep talking so you can find me again. <clears throat> right here, sir. I was like, bro. Why are you here, bro? Didn't you know? Finally. I have tango fever. Thing is, nobody held a gun to your head. Why did you take his offer? It was time for a change. Sorry, sir. Learning the truth about your partner. Did you see? I read your ICO profile. All those years. You took a contract for one to the world. Only to serve your personal friends and his life. Manny Russo of Goldberg and Partners calling for Beer St. Martin, please. Thank you. Mrs. St. Martin, just calling to check on those accounts we discussed. Which is correct. Yeah, Panama, Dominica, and Costa Rica. And my instructions were followed to the letter. Splendid. I shall inform Mr. Yates. Mr. Yates is dead. Your guess is as good as mine. Yates's mystery client is setting up a Kafka-esque labyrinth of staggering complexity. Shell companies and phantom accounts looping in on themselves like a Mobius strip in a bad suit. I got a nosebleed just thinking about it. Okay, okay, okay. Between you and me, why is he talking? I couldn't help but follow a few breadcrumbs, and here's the strangest part. The money all seems to flow from another older shell corporation called Providence. The name rings a bell? Yes, that terrorist transmission a few months ago. Now, the thing was controlled by three families. Oh my God, still talking. Money, the Carlisles of the Carlisle Shipping Group, the Ingram Oil and Steel Texas, and the Stuyvesant U.S. Yes. That is when I decided as my mentor taught me, cash my check and mind my own goddamn business. Words to live by, yeah? Well, same to you. Why was that important? Why did he give me... Usually whenever there's an important thing on the bottom, you read it as like text in the subtitles. Other than that, if it's not important, then it doesn't appear. But that didn't give me any intel. That was just nothing. He was just talking. Oh, excuse me. I still don't know where Mr. Vargas is. Maybe I should check the house. I don't even know if I could send him down there anyway. 
They're just for decoration anyway. Uh, say, you're one of those busy chefs. So you're the brother, right? You're... Pablo Yosa, the youngest. I'm the by bumping off Rico Delgado and his fixer, Andrea Martinez, needs a crash course in history. Oh, I think one last drug lord would be a good thing. Well, not if they're the lesser evil. Rico Delgado was a son of a bitch, but... That's a little too close. Plus, a stabilizing what happened to factor for the whole region. Fine, now the cartel is in the hands of mad dog Hector Delgado. Well, that's Diana. I was about to kill her, but they're separated. Why does he have a gun in his hand? What is happening? What the heck is happening with this lady? Let's head back to the party. Whatever you say. There's some sloppy wiring. Just an accident waiting to happen. Occupational hazard. A Burnwood? That was weird. Why'd they go down there? Uh, well, I'll just use it for that. She's going back up now. I'm gonna get rid of that torch. Oh, he drank it. It wasn't even her drink. Jesus. Do I want to take his outfit? Yeah, why not? I'm not killing you. Relax. Damn, what is that guy doing? Oh, I found the freaking board, though. Oh. You calm down. Hmm? Sir, don't do it. I mean, it shouldn't shock you anyway. Shoot! Sir! Nice. Thank you. Uh, let's check out this area a little bit. What's going on? Restroom, bathroom, he just... I'm wicked smart, and yet I find myself in these situations all the time. Damn it. Hey, 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 get up! This is a hostile area for me? I'm not allowed in here? Maybe the other costume was better. Time out. What the fuck? Okay. Well, let's grab another emetic poison, I guess. Where are the ornamental torches? Go ah, put them in the gun. I want them lit before that. 
What do you believe in, Vidal? I believe most people need to be led. They want it too, mind you. They've just been brainwashed by liberal humanism. What happens if I just push her off now? To think is something to resist. Ah, I can't push her? Might is right. Is that it? Any dumb mob or chest pounding gorilla has might. I believe in merit, the rule of competence. Those who are born with superior skills and intellect have a moral obligation to lead. It's as simple as that. Wow. You're just a social media shitstorm waiting to happen, aren't you? Don't talk to me about privilege. When the. Oh! Oh! Take him down! Shit. The one to Let's go. <gasps> Diana's like, what the hell are you doing? I was curious. Something to be ashamed of. Might is right. Is that it? Any dumb mob or chest pounding gorilla has might. I believe in merit, the rule of competence. Those who are born with superior skills and intellect have a moral obligation to lead. It's as simple as that. Wow. You're just a social media shitstorm waiting to happen, aren't you? Don't talk to me about privilege. When the enemy is at the gates, you want the best man leading the charge. Privileged. Or not. Questioning natural hierarchy. Warmonger. The fuck? You yell at me? Hey, huh? You buy it? It's not unreasonable. Oh my god. I'm just running around now, I guess. I don't know what I can pull off. I'm not allowed over here though, aren't I? Tell Joe I say hi. Okay, I am allowed over here. Now what's going on over here? Trespassing, what the fuck? How am I trespassing? Better just grab the banana and use that. The heck am I? Oh fuck. Hey you, this is a restricted area. Now, you are going to follow me. Nice and easy. Stay calm and you'll be fine. Understood? That's right. Following like a cute little puppy. I'm definitely gonna switch That's fine, see. outfits. Let's go ahead. Hello, cowboy. What the heck? Can I dismantle the 
edges? What the frick? Or can I climb it? I could climb it. Okay. That makes more sense. What's the point of going up here? Oh, there's a sniper up here. Rich scratch their asses too when they think nobody's watching. <laughs> Don't be crude. Pay attention. Yates wants us on high alert. We've been at this for months. Ever since the 1% killings began. Nothing's gonna happen. I know. But when you start thinking like that, that's when it does. Who are we on the lookout for anyway? Yates didn't say. Stand by for a picture ID and a kill order. Fine. I'll just practice my lip reading. I wonder if he was trying to kill me or um, Diana. They're, oh my god, I know where they're at now. They're going down to the electrocution area that I was trying to do. Ugh, pff, that's so far now. What? Shut up. Oh my god. Right, I'm not going to make that. I'm going to have to wait until they... This is when they separate down there. I just gotta stick with them. That's what I gotta do now. I'm just gonna snipe her now. Come on, guys. Let's fight the shooter. On it, on it. Calling from the tank. Nothing to report. Over. Oh, oh. Come on. Just wait for them to poke their head out, and I'm gonna shoot them from here. Hua! It's a good spot for sniping in general. Sorry, what the heck was that? Got him. Brother from another brother. The hell? Does everybody recognize me? Okay, so there's where the watermelons are at. Where is this? This is... Oh, okay. I found out where I am now. There's one thing then I want to try. Hmm. Where's Diana? 
She's scared. No, it's just that one of Yates is quiet. Bienvenidos to Viñeda. Bienvenidos to Viñ. I need to see an invitation before I can let you in. Okay, let's go, sir. Thank you. Huh? Okay. Evening, senor. Would you care for an aperitif? Oh, yes. Would you like to dance? Oh, on the dance floor. Oh, yes. Come, 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 come. Come, Diana, let's dance. You and me. I've been waiting for this moment. They found the body. What is this? Let me dance it's in peace. Done. Now what? Now we strike at the heart. Edwards. You know how to find him, don't you? Why, Edwards finds you, 47. He is untraceable, and he never lets you forget it. He is cocky, and that will be his downfall. What's the plan? Too many eyes. Meet me at the Olive Grove at sunset. One last tango, 47. This was cool, what the heck? The last tango, I did it. I could not figure out a way to do what she needed. There were so many ways for Don Yates that I like, I guess I completely forgot all of her stuff. Oh, nice, a tranquilizer gun. Vineyard. Why do I feel like she's playing both of us, though? How did you know? <gasps> Your deal. That kind of power always comes with a price. What's yours? I think you know. What is happening? We danced! I am sorry. This is a necessary evil. She placed it on him. I knew it. Ether Brown's neurotoxin. I knew it. Transfers by touch. When she touched us in the beginning. Edwards learns by his mistakes, 47. And as you've clearly demonstrated, brute force is futile. It had to be me. I fucking knew it. It was the only way. To get this close. My family. I know what you did. After all these years, I finally know. I am sorry. You didn't have a choice. I did. Providence used you, but I'm no better. All I saw was a blank slate, a weapon to wield. I told myself it was what you needed, but people aren't meant to be controlled. This is a kindness. Goodbye, Agent. The fuck is that? Untouchable. God damn it. I was happy. And then I was sad. Ah! I'm upset. She hates me. Uh, 
Now we gotta kill Diana. Do we not kill Diana? I don't know. Alright, what was her thing? Poison glass of Pinot Noir. Electrocution, great pressure. She okay, she in the hypothermia. I couldn't dress up as him. That's what messed me up. I had to dress up as him. Or Vargas too. No, I just had to dress up as him, but I had to find Vargas because then we couldn't tour the place. Then we would have been stuck. I don't know who's Vargas though, which sucks. Is he on here anywhere? Oh, it's that's what he looks like. That's probably him. The hell? Dinner party. She fucking betrayed me, bro. God damn it. I'm so mad. But I knew it was gonna happen. I knew it was gonna happen. Let me use the bathroom real quick, I'll be right back. I don't know. So a part of me wants to just go to the mountains and just like go into it. But like 
breathing. But like, I'm like, I have to wait. Take it one step at a time. I still have a bunch of shit to do here. You know? Let's run it back one more time. Someone text me. Yep. Started the parking lot. Because I don't want to talk to Diana. We're not on speaking terms. I never use this freaking thing. Let's start there. This time I'm turning on the mission stories again, but not full. Since I had my first run. She's been living alone here for what, right. six years? Ever since the scandal that ruined her career. Perfect marriage. I'm sorry. Mr. Yates? It's Darren, sir. From the firm. I came as quickly as I could. Yes, sir. I have a file. No, no access. Bienvenidos to Viñeda Yates, senor. Yes. Thank you. Huh? Okay. What's it? Huh? No. Okay. So I want to try to do this one again. And welcome to the Yates Winery. How? Stare. Busted heads for less. That man's a beast. I know the stories. Started out in narcotics. Got fired from his condo. Not to mention him. Is that he recognizes me? Let me guess, the Burnwood woman. That's right. Yates has arranged for the chief winemaker to take Burnwood and Tamara Vidal on a grand tour of the estate. Let's see the tag along. Not for my sparkling personality. This Burnwood woman sure has his panties in a twist. Wonder what the deal is. Yates' business is secret. Get yourself ready and sign into the visitor center. Oh, have a drink on my behalf. I don't drink. A private tour of the estate. Diana. Vidal and this fixer, Corvo Black. Black is a threat, but also an opportunity. Yates's own machinations are inconsequential. Joining the tour will give access to Vidal, away from the crowd. Black or Vargas? Okay. Interesting. Um, what was I doing? So it looks like the mission story for the lawyer is not even included in this, which is interesting. Makes me sentimental. Mister, who are you again? Tamara Vidal. I'm here for the tour, it seems. Ah, yes. Miss Vidal. My apologies. I didn't recognize you. Let me see. Son of a bitch. By the militia and held hostage for you. Luther? Burnwood's flying solo. I want all eyes on. Let's see what she does. And Luther, he deployed the birds and key in on the party area. We're spread too thin. Too many blind spots. Anyone as much as sneeze in the wrong direction, I want to know about it. The old land. And I see your tour guide is none other than Gabriel Vargas, the state's chief winemaker. <laughs> this is a rare privilege. You and the Yates, must be very close. Nothing quite spoils a party like your guests. Stand by. So you're not sure yet? Does that mean there's a plan A? One where I don't stand a 50-50 chance of getting caught? I mean, you do realize the risk here, boss. Broad daylight, workers around. It's but a nice day. she's pissing on your parade. It's not even been appointed to but if I'm going to be one of these heralds of yours, you need to start letting me in on a few things. I'm more of a beer man myself. So who's this fool? Yates wants to bring the heralds closer together and play the modern boss. I don't actually mind. No, no problem. I just never framed an urban legend before. Very post-truth. I like it. Not even Thomas Cross or Eugene Cobb had a direct line of contact. 
Oh. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna definitely dress up as Corvo. How do you feel about Burnwood? How do you think? She and her friends. Ah, that would have been a perfect electrocution. Man, why do you walk so slow, dude? Oh my god. Just in case. Who found the body? Nobody. What the hell? Alright, cool. Was I supposed to dress up as Vargas because Corvo, Corvo was gone? I'm on the tour. Right, Mr. Black. Welcome. Miss Burnwood and Miss Vidal will meet you down by the wine fields. I trust you know the way. I can find my way around. Enjoy your tour. Join the other guests down there. Purple. Over here. You two must be Burnwood and Vidal. And you must be Yates's garbage man. Sorry, but I didn't catch your name. This is Corvo Black, Tamara. He's a ICA regular. I only work with the best. Well, we're all here, it seems. Except for our guide, the chief winemaker. Looks like we're stuck here until someone fetches him. Mr. Black, I'm looking in your direction. Hold on. I'll track him down. At a boy. To try and bring him back in one he day. was in here. What the hell? Where is he? What? What is he now? What? You have some guests waiting. Senor Yates wanted you to give them a grand tour. Remember? If I don't have more important things to say than baby. You're not that important. It's only harvest season. That is what he said, Patron. Big shot to your lawyer like that. Don't want to get on the bad side. Well, I'm not going anywhere until I have decided if the crop is right for picking. Bring me the three grapes, How's that? Three grapes, was it? I'll get my picking knife. Yo, how did I not find these guys at all? That's baffling. They gave me so much time, too, to figure it out. Okay, I can't go under it. I'm gonna pick some grapes. Jesus, there's so many people here.
this one. Um, two. Three. Excuse me. This is a private area. Play time is over. The guards will set you straight. Manu, I have to go to work. Hey, shit. What's going on? No one is trespassing. Looks like he doesn't give a shit. Now leave it to a real man. Wait, what? I need you to follow me. Did I fuck up the mission story because it was stuck in the investigate the hold up part? Because now it's telling me to dress as a wine worker. That's right. Following like a cute little puppy. God, my ear. Good job, sir. Just keep moving. That's fine, senor. Just go ahead. Hey, you! Get in there! Hold it right there! What? I'm out of here. Oh, yeah. You're doing good, buddy. That's right. Go! Go! I don't want to see your pretty face again. So, what? Yo. What? Join the other guys. Okay, it's on track still. How weird. Hmm. Ah, my fellow wine lovers. Hello, welcome to Vineda Yates. I do apologize for the delay, but the Malbec grape is a demanding mistress. So, I am Gabriel Vargas, chief wine maker, and I will be your tour guide. Any questions before we start? Yes, but you're not going to like them. I, uh... We're good. Lead the way, Senor Vargas. Wonderful. Follow me. These are busy times. In fact, we're just about to harvest this year's crop. Great expectations. Hey. So, how do you <laughs> like Argentina? Like everywhere else. Full of Americans. First stop on the tour is the production floor, where our prize-winning Malbec grapes are processed. We insist on distilling every grape by hand. Which means that during harvest season, the grapes do tend to pile up. Luckily, we have plenty of storage space. Our equipment is state-of-the-art, including an industrial-sized freezer unit, and last but not least, our trusty grape crusher. Interesting. Wouldn't you say, Mr. Black? Follow me, please. Are you a wine man, Black? Somehow you don't seem the type. Oh, I believe Mr. Black here is something of a jack of all trades. Isn't that so? I dabble. I see. I just thought Yates might be sending a message. My mistake. So, have any of you been to our vineyard before? Only on business. Next on our tour is the fermentation atrium, where the wine goes to its primary stage of fermentation. In these big open tanks, Yeast converts the sugars in the wine to alcohol in a process that lasts between 5 and 15 days. This is also where we squeeze the mass into a fine juice using our grape presser before the longer secondary stage of fermentation. Fascinating. Now, before we move on, do any of you have questions? I have a question. It's... perhaps we can take a closer look. Certainly. Lead the way. What can you tell me about this freezer? 
This is an industrial coal storage unit where we keep our excess grape stock to prevent decay. It easily reaches temperatures of minus 10 degrees Celsius. Trust me, you don't want to stay in here for long. No kidding. Hey, there's no doorknob on the inside. Seems like a pretty glaring safety omission, if you ask me. Probably soundproof, too. And good luck getting a phone signal. Such imaginations you have. But there really is no need to worry. Why? We haven't had an accident since Mrs. Yates' dog was run over by a grey picker. What Did the hell? Wish to know? There's really no trouble. I mean, that worked. Oh, uh, yeah. I have a couple more questions if you want to follow me. How do we get up there to ask questions? Also, why is she not dead yet? Oh, now she did. That was like perfect timing, which I think is hilarious. Let's continue to the barrel room. I think you'll follow me. Yeah. What happened to your colleague? Urgent call. Something about work. I don't think she'll be coming back. Oh, well. I'm sure she can find her way out. Let's proceed. The hell? <laughs> Yourself. Where'd you go? Oh, oh he's so, here. Are you associates of Mr. Yates? You might say we run in the same circles. Law and order must be very exciting. It's about 99% preparation. And so we arrive to our final stop. The hmm. Okay, there's another thing. Barrel room. This is where we store the wine during the secondary stage of fermentation. The area behind the glass is where we keep our most precious bottles. Including a 1945 Grand Paladin, the most expensive wine in existence. The access doors, which are made from ballistic glass, can only be unlocked from the security room. Could I shoot to him through here? Yeah, keep it real. Oh, he's coming through here. Oh. oh. Shall leave you in his capable hands. You heard it. How reassuring. It. Ah, Miss Burnwood, is it not? Don Yates. Pleased to meet you. Come very highly recommended. As chief of the heralds, let me be the first to say welcome aboard. Why, thank you, Mr. Yates. Rest assured that I will be following your every lead very closely. Say, that reminds me. We're about to have a little herald get together up at the house. Just a modest toast to celebrate my forthcoming inauguration as constant. You are, of course, most welcome to join us. I believe you shall make a fine herald. Once the training wheels are off. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Capital, right this way. Into the lion's den. <laughs> Why don't you take a break, Corvo? We're done here for now, I think. Oh, but don't go too far. I may still need your services later. I'll be closer than you think. Oh, almost forgot. Cortazar, please nip down to the wine cellar and tell Mr. Flowers, the sommelier, to prep the 1945 Grand Paladin, oh. bring it up to the house for our special occasion. Got it, Chief. Mr. Yates wants the 1945 Grand Paladin brought up to the house. Special occasion. What? But did aliens land on the front lawn? Have the ghosts of Jesus, John Lennon, and Ava Perel unexpectedly come for dinner? Help me out here. 
What could possibly be so special? Above your clearance, Flowers. A meeting in the Your psychopath? Cellar. I'm judging from Yates' choice of wine. Some type of celebration. Hmm. Likely a gathering of heralds. Come to congratulate Yates on his upcoming promotion. Diana's presence. A calculated risk. Okay. Just fetch it already. Fine. What's the passcode again? Last year of World War II. Hey, we need some help here. You guys didn't see shit. to search you if you want the ah, la, la, la. There you go. That's good. Keep those arms there. Don't move. Psycho guy. If I find something, I'm gonna crucify you. All right. All good. Go on. Go up, right? Yeah. Oh. I have always considered the heralds the unspoken heroes of Providence. The nervous system. Effectively and Senor, you are not allowed to pass. Where's the head of the security? Are you the head of security? I'm sorry, I mean I'm not allowed in here. My my apologies. <clears throat> that was worth a shot. This wine was gifted to me by the Art Society in acknowledgement of my firm's legal services. It stands as a powerful reminder that Providence draws its strength not from force, but from partnership. We are but a few, and yet together, we are. Who's the head of security? Because Greetings, we stand sir. United, my friends, loyalty is everything, which is why we cannot allow traitors into our oh. land. Oh, yes. Here it comes. This woman has waged bloody war on us. Cousin Harold's an operative's dead. Your colleagues and clients, my friend. To mention the partners themselves, our founder, our benefactor. Oh, shortcut. No oh, nice. And the Providence is handing her the keys to the kingdom. Now, does that seem right to you, my friends? Hey, does that sound you? like loyalty? Is any our amigo? Right. So Perhaps Edward simply to... recognizes talent when he sees it. Perhaps this is why I am also in the running to become constant and following this childish outburst. I dare say I am in the lead, Don. What? what You're lying, saying? of course. Which only proves my point. You cannot be trusted, Miss Burnwood. This woman will be our downfall. That is, unless we take matters into our own hands. 
You are heralds, sworn to protect Providence against all threats, including inside ones. I have devised a plan. Together we can make it work, but you have to decide now, my friends. Are you with me? Yes. Yes, I agree. Yes. I'm in. Escort Miss Burnwood to my office. I'll join you shortly. Oh! Right. Move it. Let's go. I'm warning you, Yates. This will not go your way. Let me save this over here in like a far away save spot, just in case that I want to come back to this point. Cause it's another shortcut. I'm liking the shortcuts. That's not what I wanted. Found a bag of gunpowder. Interesting. I'm gonna use this cool ass broadsword to kill him. Jesus, what what is in here? Broadsword, pirate saber, cannonball. Let me grab that cannonball real quick. A freaking sniper too? Hunting rifle? Painting of nothing? Is there no stairs to go down? Ah, yes, okay. Okay, I can't kill him with the broadsword. Pirate sword instead, I guess. You know what, boss? Can I not bring the pirate sword either? God damn it. You shouldn't be talking. It took you long enough. Quick, clear the floor and get yourself a guard outfit. Yates Ready won't be long. She's playing me like a sucker. I hate it. How is this? Pick up a calendar. What the hell is the point of this? Uh, wait, what? 
On the 2021 calendar found in the Eats household, a date that has been circled with the words Crystal Anniversary scribbled alongside of it. Interesting. Basement key. I was beginning to worry. Were you? No. Listen up, 47. Yates will be here shortly. He'll have his thug Cortazar do his dirty work, but he won't pass up on the chance for a good gloat and a monologue. So, private space? Kill room decor? Exactly. We won't get another shot at this. Now sit down and blend in. When I provide a distraction, you just be ready to move. Oh, I don't have a propane tank, but that would be great. One second, let me save right there. Propane, propane, propane. Any propane up here? No, no. Never mind, go back. Cortazar will bring the package. Get it done. Miss Burnwood. You rolled out the red carpet just for me. Don, you shouldn't have. So confident, even in defeat. I suppose you're not used to danger, always safe behind your screens. Just tell me one thing before we part ways. Why me? Why? Why would Edwards trust you? Please. It will keep me awake at nights, and I'm 65. I get up four times to piss as it is. Oh, it's simple, really. Edwards is proud. He considers himself the cleverest man alive, and yet we tricked him on Isle of Scale, and it's eating him up. He needs to win. Full, unequivocal victory. My recruitment was just the feather in his cap. By the way, you were right about one thing. Yeah, I'm all ears. Holy shit. Oh, snap! Oh, wait, wait, time out. If it's any consolation, Don, what are you doing, you asshole? Don't just stand there! Shoot her! And I will make it my mission to tear down Providence, brick. Finish it. Uh, such a good boy. The freaking dead body on the side. I was not expecting her to kill him. I wasn't prepared. Hide the body. Hide all the body. Well done, 47. Better get rid of the body. Oh my god. They come looking. Oh my god, here you go. There's so many bodies in here. Oh, there's a freaking thing right here. Nice. Evil Wine Club. Vision story complete. So I'm not gonna... What, what keys do I have? Basement key. That's all, really? The keys to Yates' car. Is there a, a challenge to escape through his car? Okay, there it is. So I'm not going to dance with Diana. I'm going to escape through his card instead, since I've completed the mission. And I'm going to go back downstairs and type in 2021 to that key code that we saw. And maybe that's going to open it up. I don't know what's behind that door, but it is a challenge to do real quick. So I'm going to do that. Just got to remember where everything is. I believe I gotta go over there.
Yep, right here. I love how he tried insulting me as he's dying. Like, and I never understand that. He's like, such a good boy. I'm like, what? Why? You're dying, bro. Relax. Say something else. Just go with it. I don't know. It's just weird. All right, perfect. 2021? Now? What the hell is the point of the calendar in the 2021 anniversary? Wow, it's for a mission story. Interesting. Sup. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Shortcut to that too. So it's right under his house. You can get to it. And what's over here? That's the shortcut outside. Okay, okay. Man, I don't know what this would be. Hmm. I tried 1945 already. Zero four twenty one. Maybe it's the date. What date is on that intel? It's the fourth. Zero four zero four. Zero four twenty one. I already did that one. It's the same freaking date. Twenty one oh four. Four four twenty one. Interesting. Okay. Anyway. Alright, let's go escape through the... Don Yates car. And then we'll be done. At least I opened up some shortcuts too, which is pretty nice. Finally, I found the last bottle. All right, sorry, Diana. I'm not ready for you to kill me right now. Where's Don Yates' car? Is it over there? Or is it up top? I'm assuming it, no, that's, that's a different exit though that I can take later. Don Yates' car is up there, and that's where it is. There's Joe, I say hi. Ah. Hey, GI Joe. Wait. Why are you calling? You're dressed like me. Why are you calling me GI Joe? Gee, they tried turning around and shooting me. Beautiful. Beautiful. Really? Zero stars for that? I guess I, I killed people because she needed me to. 
At least I start as a a server. Now I have that on watch. All right, I want to watch this again and see what the hell, what the actual hell. She meant to kill me then. Obviously it didn't work, but she meant to kill me. No. This I don't understand. What is How he? Did you know? Your deal. What deal? That kind of power always comes with a price. What's yours? I think you know. Because she's becoming the constant, and he's like, wait, that doesn't even make sense. Why are you becoming the constant? What's the deal? Sorry. This is a necessary evil. What have you done? Eat the brand's neurotoxin. Transfers by touch. See, Edwards learns by his mistakes, 47. And as you've clearly demonstrated, brute force is futile. It had to be me. It was the only way. To get this close. My family. I know what you did. After all these years, I finally know. I am sorry. You didn't have a choice. I did. Providence used you, but I'm no better. All I saw was a blank slate, a weapon to wield. I told myself it was what you needed, but people aren't meant to be controlled. This is a kindness. Doesn't feel like Goodbye. one. Agent. Messed up. Alright. Well, I'm going to try to do all the challenges as I usually do off screen. Then I'll come back with the escalations and then we'll finally be in the something mountains. Alive again. Maybe she's still good. I don't know. I'm off to kill some more people. Here I am. Come back from the dead. Well, I don't know. I'm depressed now. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you again soon. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Hope you have a good one. And goodbye.